Hi guys, welcome back. Just a quick one today. Um, just going to go over wedding photography and turnaround times and sort of editing in general. It's going to be a very quick one. So what I do with all my weddings is just take them into Lightroom, put my preset on. Obviously you can do other programs like Capture One or you know whatever you use. Copy paste, <clears throat> go across the images, look at the tint and the white balance, so obviously make sure they're balanced, and then export. And then only do I take really the main sort of hero images of the couples and tweak them in Photoshop, which will just be removing certain things like maybe a couple of blemishes if it's really obvious um, or anything in the background or like, you know, like fire exit signs. But apart from that, it's done and dusted. And get through a wedding, can go through them in Lightroom, pick the ones which are good, and export in about four hours. Um, the, the, the six to eight week wait, that's long gone now. People just don't do that anymore. And with obviously social media and people having everything uh, straight away, this is actually like what's happening moving forward. And especially with the whole AI thing, it's just gonna get quicker and quicker. Now it's something I've always done, but three to four hour turnaround, should be straightforward and even picking the images people sort of mull over images and the rule of thumb I've always used is go through the images as you go along and select the ones that you like if you're pondering over an image that's it it's already in the bin just don't use it there'll be another one especially if you're taking five shots of the same area um, and that's it really this is what you should be aiming for depending on what you use and obviously how fast your system is. If you're, if you're going through like 800, well, say about 2,000 images for a wedding on Lightroom, you need quite a good computer to, especially if you've got a sort of 36 to 45 megapixel camera, to sort of select those quickly, do the edit and then export, and you'd say export and say about 800 images. Um, this computer will do it in about five minutes flat. Um, but obviously, like my MacBook M1, especially with some of the, the, the cameras I use, can take a lot longer. So it just makes everything and the process just so much quicker. And that's it. I hope you like the video. My affiliate links are down below for the Prime FX lens as well. So if you want to go and take a look at that and get 15% off. Um, and I will see you next time.